My name is Tolga. I'm a student at the Royal College of Music on the Artist Diploma course. I'll also be the Mills Williams Junior Fellow this year. Here is an amazing instrument. Um, it's a copy by Bruce Kennedy of an instrument by Michael Mitke. It has just arrived in college and I'm one of the first people to play on it and record on it, so I'm very privileged. The word that came to my mind um, when I first tried this instrument was noble. I sat down to play a few chords and I immediately felt like buttoning my jacket up with respect, you know. Um, it has such a resonant and clear sound. And I had played on so many different harpsichords before with different um, registration facilities and different sound qualities, but never had I played on an instrument with such a resonant and clear singing, sing late on the lower manual. So it's a very special instrument. It's very concentrated sound. It's very um, singing and beautiful. I chose this particular Prelude and Fugue um, because it demonstrates a um, variety of um, the performance skills. For example, the Prelude is a um, toccata-style two-part invention where the performer can show his finger work, <laughs> literally. And then the contrasting fugue is a, is a richly contrapuntal texture and the clarity of sound on the lower manual eight, single eight, without coupling it, uh, allows the performer to show this clear contrapuntal writing. So that's why I chose this period and fugue. I think it allows the performer to show facilities of this instrument very well. One of the other reasons why I chose this particular piece is because we have one of the earliest manuscripts of this piece um, in the library here at the college uh, by Friedrich Wilhelm Marburg, who was a very important theorist and composer, music critic, and journalist at the time. And it's, I think, very important to have such an amazing um, manuscript available to us so that we have a closer contact with the composer and their time. This manuscript actually comes from Bach's time and was copied by uh, one of his copyists, a gentleman called Marburg. Um, it actually contains 22 of the 24 uh, fugues and only the fugues from the second book of the Well Tempered Clavier. Um, here we've got the D minor fugue that you just heard. Um, the manuscript itself came into the college as one of our founding manuscripts uh, back in the 1880s um, and is a really important source for this work. Um, there is no complete autograph manuscript of the second book and so actually these items actually become very important to find out what Bach was wanting to transmit to eternity. The college is incredibly lucky to have extensive special collections. We have nearly 20,000 manuscripts running from the 16th century through to the 21st century. And usually this source actually only contains 22 of the 24 fugues and none of the preludes, um, which again suggests it probably was copied by Marburg because that was the, the area that he was really interested in. One of the greatest pleasures of being the librarian at the Royal College of Music is to give students the opportunity to see these sources and to see how that affects the way that they approach the music and how it then um, reflects in the performances they give.